Hello, I'm Elliot Harper from Cloud Kettle, and welcome back to Marketing Cloud Minutes. In this episode, I want to share a great tip to easily update email content blocks used in Triggered Send and Journey emails. There are several methods for including a content block in an email at send time. You can either add dynamic content, reference content, or a content block AMP script function to your email. And when the email is sent, the respective content block will be included. But when a triggered send or journey email is sent, the platform creates a snapshot of content blocks the first time that they're rendered. Then that snapshot is reused across subsequent sends. As a result, when these content blocks are updated, the updates won't be reflected in emails until the triggered send definition is republished or the journey email activity summary is opened and then closed. And if the content block is used across many emails, for example, a global footer content block, then you might need to manually update hundreds of triggered send definitions and journey email activities, which is a very time-consuming task. But here's a quick tip to quickly republish all triggered send and journey emails in just a few clicks. Open the Admin tab in Email Studio and click on Auto Suppression Configuration. Then click Create. Define a list name, then choose both as your send classification type. And in a parent business unit, you can also choose whether you want to apply the list to a specific business unit or all of them. Click Save, then click Update to close the dialog window. The platform will now republish all triggered send and journey emails in related business units. You don't even need to add record to the list. And deleting the list also performs the same republish action. Well, I hope you found this tip helpful. See you next time.